These are cars in great demand and rightly highly desired for their combination of versatility, comfort, refinement, and performance, both on and off the road. Genuine 4x4 ability is common amongst them, as is the utmost in luxury, space, and refinement. And amongst the many factors motivating buyers, stylish design and brand allure are becoming increasingly important. In today's video, we will be showing you most luxurious SUVs in the world. Without further ado, let's begin. Number 10. Genesis GV80 It's a bit reductive to say so, but if you fancy a Bentley Bentayga for a fraction of the price, then the Genesis GV80 is as close as it gets. From its bold, bluff-fronted looks through to its richly luxurious interior and similarly be-winged badge, the Korean upstart does a good job at being a facsimile at a fraction of the cost. Okay, so the comparisons only stand up loosely, but there is a lot to like in the GV80, which was the first model from Hyundai's premium brand to arrive on European shores. The Genesis is certainly imposing, while inside it's roomy and has a fit and finish that makes established players at this end of the market sit up and take notice. Number 9. Range Rover Veller The Range Rover Veller is Land Rover's most road-biased SUV yet, with looks taken straight from those of the concept car, an interior that puts most others to shame with its richness in both materials and technology, and a model platform adapted from one primarily developed for its group partner brand Jaguar. On the road, it's every bit as good to drive as it is to simply admire, with ride, refinement, performance, and handling precision, every bit as good as any car in the class, provided you don't skip on cylinder count when you specify your car. Four-cylinder engines are much poorer than the sixes, while the plug-in lacks the pace, refinement, and EV range of the newer Range Rover and Range Rover Sport. Number 8. Volvo XC90 Volvo's renaissance following Ford ownership started with the XC90, a genuine seven-seater with comfort and handling on its side, a decent range of engines, including a T8400 and one brake horsepower plug-in hybrid, as well as an abundance of style. It's another car that sits directly in the middle of the luxury SUV price spectrum. The interior features a mix of luxury touches and not-so-luxury plastics in places, while less-than-perfect engine refinement and infotainment usability niggles ensure the XC90 stops just short of greatness. Nonetheless, Volvo made worthwhile improvements to the car's engine range when it replaced the D5 diesel with a new mild hybrid B5 option in 2019. Number 7. Mercedes-Benz GLE Mercedes-Benz has redoubled its commitment to the luxury SUV market by investing in a new vehicle platform and by making the first model to use it, the fourth-generation GLE, predecessors of which used to be known as the ML class, a bit of a technological pioneer. Having grown in size considerably compared with the old GLE, the new one has a more rigid mixed-metal body structure too. It offers considerably more space for second- and third-row passengers. The seven-seat option isn't available with the plug-in hybrid than its predecessor, and what Mercedes bills as a markedly more upmarket luxury ambience in all seats. Number 6. Audi Q7 The Q7 is a desirable, polished SUV with a real aura of accomplishment. Huge inside, with high-quality materials and a very high level of refinement and mechanical isolation, it may be the embodiment of everything you want in a modern upmarket family car particularly if you consider cars like this the modern manifestation of luxury in automotive form. The downsides? In typical Audi fashion, the Q7 feels quite remote to drive, handles in grippy and effective but uninvolving fashion, and is a little short on the charisma that other cars in this class have in abundance. Number 5. BMW X5 the fourth generation of Munich's full-sized luxury 4x4 signals a maturing and broadening of the X5's character definition, but not a wholesale change of it. Twenty years ago, when BMW revolutionized and revitalized this part of the luxury car market with the original X5, it hit on a powerfully appealing concept. That of a sporting SUV with as much space, versatility, and 4x4 capability as many needed but not enough to dull its dynamic edge. 
Today, the G05 Generation X5 still represents that notional positioning. It's smaller and lower than many of its rivals, with a more saloon-like recumbent driving position. It has a richer and more expensively finished cabin than its predecessor, so it gives away a little on luxury ambience and has a sizable boot. Number 4. Porsche Cayenne The car that saved Porsche entered its third model generation in 2018 and, in doing so, eased out its VW Group platform buddy, the Audi Q7, for a place at the sharp end of this class ranking. The latest Cayenne isn't quite the driver's car we've all come to know and that many of us came to begrudgingly respect after taking so powerfully against what the car seemed to represent in its first iteration back in 2002. Because Porsche is still Porsche, it still makes the very best sports cars in the world, thanks in no small part to a business that's now built on the commercial bedrock of luxury SUVs. The KN in its current form is plainly a car that's content to leave the sports car impressions to its little sibling the Mekin and instead to play the high-quality, luxury SUV with greater focus than any of its forebears have. It's still delivering driver appeal that's distinguishing, if not quite outstanding. Number 3. Land Rover Discovery The second podium for Land Rover in the luxury SUV segment is delivered by a car whose character differs starkly from that of the car above, but may be all the more appealing to you for its relative lack of machismo the fifth-generation Land Rover Discovery. It's a car of controversial but rugged styling, with off-road ability that few in the class could beat, and with a brief to provide functional, understated, comfortable luxury and versatility on the road, and that succeeds at that task with likable ease. Seven usable seats are inside, and when you're driving you'll have a great time because this is as comfortable a cruiser as many traditional, saloon-shaped luxury cars. Number 2. Audi Q8 e-tron Quattro The pace of development of the luxury electric car is something to behold right now. Five or so years ago, an all-electric option would barely have threatened to get to the top of this list. But today, the inherent qualities of electrified propulsion are really being brought to bear by the very best luxury EVs on the market. And there can be no doubt that the Audi e-tron Quattro is one of them. Launched in 2018, the e-tron was treated to a midlife refresh and name change, becoming the Q8 e-tron at the very end of 2022. Subtle sharper looks are the most obvious change on the inside, while the battery capacity has been up to 89 kWh in the entry-level 50 model and 106 kWh for the 55 and sporier SQ8 variants. Number 1. Range Rover Sport the luxury SUV market is increasingly crowded, with brands eager to take a slice of this overly profitable pie. Yet, while increasingly talented new arrivals continue to make a bid for supremacy, there's a familiar name at the top of our list, the Range Rover Sport. All new from the ground up in 2022, this third-generation machine takes off where its class-leading predecessor left off. As ever, it's not quite as large or as spacious as its bigger sibling the Range Rover and isn't the lightest car of its kind. According to our scales, it's around 150 kilograms heftier than the old car. But the Range Rover Sport more than makes up for it with its remarkable breadth of talent. So guys, let me know your thoughts down in the comments section below. For more interesting content, give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. Have a nice day and I will see you in the next video.